YouTubers, Alexandrina here. Okay, so first I just want to say a massive sorry for this video being almost a week late. I am so sorry for that. Honestly, I've been putting this video off. I didn't really want to do it, but I already said I was going to do it, so what can you do? If you watched my last video, then you know that this video is about anxiety. Oh god, honestly, it's... It's weird talking about anxiety because so many people go through it. It's not very uncommon. And because of that, I feel like if I if I talk about my experiences, I might offend people. Um, I know my mum has told people um, about my channel and she has people who want to see this video. And that was putting a little bit of pressure onto me, which you may not think that is pressureful or whatever the word is. But for me, that is. So, for me, anxiety, it, it, it's weird. I, on my calendar, because I have a calendar um, over there, a uh, Marvel calendar, yes, but hey. Um, on my calendar, I, whenever I go out, I write down on it, went out. And the last time I went out was last Saturday for my writing group and you know I, I go out once a week at, at the most the least and that's only because I have my writing group and I have my youth group if I didn't have that I probably wouldn't go out at all anxiety it it, it affects the way that I am around people it makes me so that I feel like I have to change myself it also sort of ties up into my paranoia because I have, I have, I'm paranoid. I have paranoia. It's, trust me, it's not something to joke about. I'll tell you about that another time though. Anxiety, it just, it makes it so that when I can be around somebody without sort of putting on a mask, I guess you can say, I can't talk to people. I can't tell people my issues. I can't tell my mum if I'm feeling down so the only way I can do that is through my writing or through my YouTubing so basically for me it is easier to be behind a camera telling the world my issues than to tell my own mother and that is really sad actually. Anxiety doesn't affect me like it would affect a lot of others I don't think. It's not to the point, yes I don't go out much, but that's just because I don't really have a reason to. I, I don't feel the need to go out and when my mum tells me I'll go walk the dog, I just can't do that. I, ju I just can't. It, it just, it racks me, I can't do it. And something so simple as that, to not be able to do that, to not be able to just go out, it's, it's weird. I think it's more less going out, more going out if someone is with me, someone knows where I'm going, um, you know, I think that's what it really is, if somebody tells me to go out, I can't do it, I'm alright if I'm on my own, but I think that's because I know that I don't have anyone to fall back on, I have to do it myself, but if I'm with somebody I know, I just feel so scared, I feel like you I, I'm just constantly wondering am I saying the right thing I know they don't want to talk to me I'm thinking oh my god I am such a bitch you know I'm just thinking all these bad things about myself and I'm just lowering my self-confidence so much and that it, it really it's annoying definitely it's annoying but I don't think or from what I know I don't think other people who are have anxiety um, are like are like that but what do I know I really don't know much about anxiety I didn't really look it up OCD yes yeah no I actually haven't looked anything else up I think I looked PDA up once pathological demand void it's not public demand attention or whatever it's called Anyway, that's all. I know this is a really crappy video. I know it's terrible um, and a real disappointment after I have made you wait for almost an entire week. But honestly, there's just not much I can say about it. Anxiety, I don't know. It's just, it's there. I know it's there. 
but it's not it's something that does affect me quite a bit sometimes but others I just don't ugh. I don't know yeah I'm sorry I just I don't know that's why I've been putting this video off really because I just I couldn't explain it it's just it's difficult I guess trying to get out what I'm feeling and trying to tell people stuff it's just hard and I know this video sucks but hey nightlight st stop hanging to the roof of your cage and trying to eat the plastic above it crazy fucking hamster crazy but then again you have to be to live here <laughs> okay so yeah video sucked but whatever uh, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe for more weird, wacky, and wonderful videos by me, Alexandrina. Y'all know you love me. I promise Monday's video will be a shit ton better. Or at least entertaining. Yeah. Nightlight, don't eat my cap! No eating the cap. No eating the cap. Sorry, chew the corner off. I'm just gonna go now because I gotta keep an eye on the little miss. She's reacting because I had to take one of her houses away because it got moldy or something. What? Probably shouldn't have said that. Bye!